Ave Mirprissima. My name is Father Braulio Maria. I am a missionary bishop of the Holy Palmarian Catholic Church. And so I am starting off a YouTube channel with the uh, intention of teaching all I can about the Holy Palmarian Church. Um, the Holy Palmarian Church is the true Church of Jesus Christ. The Church was in Rome, Rome apostatized, and now it has been transferred to El Palmar to try in Spain. So there's a lot to talk about. Um, there's, a, I'm, there's a lot to say, a lot of things to be known about the Palmarian Church that is, that is not known. We have a website that explains a lot of stuff. It has a lot of publications, a lot of doctrinal uh, publications, a lot of different informations that would be just fabulous if you would just go into our website and um, examine what's in the website and read for yourself. So um, my videos that I will be doing will be, well, be probably short videos explaining different things, different aspects of the Palmarian Church. There's a lot of stuff out there that's not very genuine, it's not true, it's there's a lot of false information. We want to give you uh, a good version, you know, the true version of what really is happening um, in the Palmarian Church. So, um, first of all, just insist a little bit about going to our website and getting to know a bit more about us. But anyway, if it's easier for you, you can just listen to me. I hope that you know I can make the videos a little bit interesting, that I can say what you want to hear. And you know, <laughs> if you want to know things about the Palmarian Church, if you want to make comments, make comments. If you if you feel that um, the way we do the videos aren't very good, well, you can comment that as well. Um, I will check all the, well, as much, as much as I can, check the comments. And if you insult me, I won't publish it, okay? So, but if you say nice things and if you just ask questions, I'll publish those comments and um, I'll do my best to answer questions about the true Pope, Pope Peter III. And I will at least be able to indicate, you know, where you can read what you need to read um, about certain questions. Like if you have doubts about anything about the ordinations, well, I'll tell you where to go and find documentation about the ordinations in Palmar de Troia. Huh? Um, <clears throat> these videos are being done um, spontaneously. I haven't prepared anything. I don't know what I'm going to say next, but that's the way we want to do these videos because we confide in God and that, you know, the Holy Ghost, he inspires us and will move us to do videos and say what we got to say. Uh, if we just copy things down and write them, um, you know, it probably would be better in some ways. But anyway, my idea is to put myself in the hands of God and the Most Holy Virgin Mary and that they give me a bit of inspiration and say what has got to be said, you know, what, what you need to hear. So it's important to hear what you need to hear, not what we think you should hear. So that's why we put ourselves, put ourselves in the hands of God and the hands of Blessed Virgin Mary and God the Holy Ghost will inspire us and please God, you will find the knowledge to be able to believe that the church, one holy Catholic, apostolic and Palmarian is the true church of Jesus Christ, once Roman, but the true church is not Roman anymore, it's Palmarian. And just to say a little bit about Palmarian, the word Palmarian comes from Palmar de Troia because Our Lady appeared in Palmar de Troia. Um, the first apparition was on the 30th of March in 1968. So um, the church took the name Palmarian from Palmar de Troia, uh, the first part, Palmar, Marian, because it's really, the church is really devoted to our Blessed Virgin Mary. You know, so that's why it's Marian, you know, so it's Palmar for Palmar de Troia, Marian for Our Lady, okay? So that's why it's called Palmarian. In Rome, they called it Roman because the church was in Rome. Now it's Palmarian, Palmarian because it's Palmar de Troia and Marian for Mary, eh? We love Our Lady. So that's something you're going to find in the Palmarian church. You're going to find lots of things about the Blessed Virgin Mary, lots of documentation. You'll find lots of beautiful hymns. Uh, you'll find beautiful statues of Our Lady, beautifully decorated 
we really love Our Lady. So, you know, if you have devotion to Our Lady, you've found the place where you should be. Eh? If you don't like Our Lady, you're not going to like us. Okay? All right. So just, just an introduction, a small introduction. We just remember one other thing, that we're really devoted to St. Joseph as well. We have lots of lovely statues of St. Joseph. We have beautiful doctrine in St. Joseph. We really do all we can to please him. We, we know that St. Joseph is the protector of the church. So um, anyway, I will do a video on St. Joseph, especially to talk about him because he's so important and I don't want to just finish up quickly talking about him. He deserves more. Okay, so that's the introduction. Um, hope you can subscribe to the channel, get loads of people to subscribe so that the true faith will spread around the world. And that's what I want to say. Ave Mary Prisima.